Hi, my name is Ed Boone. I am creative director for Mortal Kombat Midway Games. Uh, today we're talking about Mortal Kombat Armageddon, which is the uh, kind of the culmination of all Mortal Kombat games into one. Every fighter that's ever been in a Mortal Kombat fighting game is represented, and uh, you know, online, side games, conquest mode, create a fighter, everything packed. It's the biggest, biggest Mortal Kombat game ever made. For E3, we're going to be showing. Uh, Pretty much every single mode of Mortal Kombat Armageddon, with the exception of one mode, which we're going to reveal a little later in the year. In this game is the Uber MK, and, and you know we we're having close to 60 characters, and there were just different things we had to wrestle with. I mean, it's like physically, like how do you actually display those characters on screen? So we we have a tablet thing that actually rotates, so you can see the characters, and they don't look like you know miniature postage stamps. A number of returning characters that you haven't seen in a long time: Striker, Shiva, Rain. Uh, sector and quite a few of the um, the new modes in the game. Creative Fighter is a new mode that we're very excited about and a brand new revamped conquest mode from the ground up which we're also very excited about. Mortal Kombat Armageddon has um, a similar fighting system to Deception but with uh, two pretty major enhancements. One is a parry move which we haven't had in any Mortal Kombat game which adds kind of like to the more defensive play of the game and another is the, the air combat. Actually the, the fighting mechanics are a little more reminiscent of the 2D games where you are jumping like uh, we haven't really done since like Mortal Kombat 4. So you have the jumping attacks and that whole strategy of jumping over projectiles and whatnot. Uh, in addition, the combos that you were able to do on the ground, you can now do in the air. So you can do some pretty crazy, um, outrageous combos where you see your character bouncing off the floor and their character bouncing off the floor. Pretty uh, insane stuff. That on top of the you know, interactive backgrounds that we introduced in Mortal Kombat Deception, you know, creates easily the most kind of unpredictable fights that we've ever had in Mortal Kombat games. Ever since the the first Mortal Kombat, we've always gotten letters from, from players, you know, saying, oh, here's a character that I made up, and he'll have this kind of move, and this, these attacks, and these fatalities. And this really is, you know, if you take every Mortal Kombat character, and you give players the ability to create their own characters, to fight against any one of those Mortal Kombat characters, or against other people's created characters online, you know, it's literally endless possibilities. It's going to be so uh, immense in terms of the possibilities. Uh, we, we have like up to 13 different uh, categories and attributes, and then there's pools of different options within there of up to 20 to, in some cases, 40 different pieces. And you define their own fighting style, you name their own fighting style, you name your character, very customizable, I'm very excited about it. Online, um, as with Deception, we have, you're know, going to have a lobby that you'll be able to go in there, find people and play against them, and there's going to be like a ranking system basically of how, how well you did against other players. Um, not only will you be able to play the fighting game online, but the new hidden mode that we have secret mode that we have in the game will also be online. Um, uh, more than two players. You know, Deception introduced a new feature called the breaker move, which basically lets you break out of a combo that somebody's, uh, that you're stuck in. And uh, that uh, was introduced in Deception that exists also in Armageddon. On top of that is this new parry move, which basically lets you, you know, block the very first hit and um, start a combo on them. The parry move, which is kind of, or the Breaker move which basically just got you out of a jam. The parry move really lets you turn the tables on your opponent. Mortal Kombat Armageddon is coming out October 2006 for the PlayStation 2 and the Xbox.